purpose. But I'm not here to give you the standard commencement about finding your purpose. We're millennials. We try to do that instinctively. Instead, I'm here to tell you that finding your purpose isn't enough. The challenge for our generation is to create a world where everyone has a sense of purpose. For our society to keep moving forward, we have a generational challenge to not only create new jobs, but create a renewed sense of purpose. You also have to create a sense of purpose for others. And I found that out the hard way. You see, my hope was never to build a company. I wanted to have an impact. And as all these people started joining us, I just assumed that that's what they wanted to do too. So I never took the time to explain what it was that I hoped we'd build. I felt alone. And worse, it was my fault. I wondered if I was just wrong, an imposter, a, a 22 year old kid who had no idea how things actually worked. Now, years later, I understand that that is how things work when there's no sense of higher purpose. So it's up to all of us to create it so we can all keep moving forward together. Ideas don't come out fully formed. They only become clear as you work on them. You just have to get started. We're afraid of making mistakes that we ignore all the things wrong today if we do nothing. The reality is, anything we do today is gonna have some issues in the future. But that can't stop us from getting started. So what are we waiting for? It is time for our generation defining great works. How it arrives when it is easy to try lots of new ideas. Facebook wasn't the first thing I built. I also built chat systems and games, study tools and music players, and I'm not alone. JK Rowling got rejected 12 times before she finally wrote and published Harry Potter. Even Beyonce had to make hundreds of songs to get Halo. The greatest successes come from having the freedom to fail. Giving everyone the freedom to pursue purpose isn't gonna be free. People like me should pay for it. And a lot of you are gonna do really well and you should too. We can be the generation that ends poverty, that ends disease. This is the struggle of our time. The forces of freedom openness and global community against the forces of authoritarianism, isolationism, and nationalism. Forces for the flow of knowledge, trade, and immigration against those who would slow them down. This is not a battle of nations. It is a battle of ideas. You are graduating into a world that needs purpose. And it's up to you to create it. Now, maybe you're asking yourself, can I really do this? I'm reminded of a prayer, Misha Beira, that I say whenever I face a big challenge, that I sing to my daughter, thinking of her future when I tuck her in at night. And it goes, may the source of strength who's blessed the ones before us. Help us find the courage to make our lives a blessing. I hope you find the courage to make your life a blessing.